World Championship na naging bato pa. Hindi makakalaro sa World Athletics Indoor Games ang pambato nating pole vaulter na si EJ Obiena. Hindi kasi siya binigyan ng endorsement ng Philippine Athletics Track and Field Association o PATAFA. Nasa front line ng balitang yan si Marty Bautista. Tapos na ang laban bago pa ito magsimula. Yan ay matapos hindi mabigyan ng pagkakataong makapaglaro sa World Athletics Indoor Championship ang Asia's top pole vaulter na si EJ Obiena. Hindi inendorso ng Philippine Athletics Track and Field Association o PATAFA ang world rank number five. I work my, I work myself hard to be where I'm at now. Yeah, I'm just devastated of that fact that I could have could have taken it if I didn't qualify. That's that's up in the air, and not for the reasons that I believe is fair. Not for me, for the country. It's a it's a shame. Kwento ni EJ, February 14 pa lang pumayag na siya sa mediation ng Philippine Sports Commission. Nagpadala pa raw siya ng letter of intent para humingi ng endorsement sa World Championship. Yun nga lang. Our job is to represent the, the country in the sporting event and we are we are one uh, as a nation and maybe we can put our differences and you know finally deal with the mediation. Um sadly, yeah, the the, the reply I got was was not uh, was not much of a friendly response. Maganda na sana ang momentum ni EJ papasok sa World Tournament. May dalawa na siyang ginto ngayong season at na-break pa niya ang kanyang indoor record na 5.91 meters sa huli niyang tournament. Pero dahil wala na siyang pag-asang makapaglaro sa World Championship, SEA Games na lang ang tututuhan ni EJ. Pasok si EJ sa SEA Games lineup ng Team Pilipinas matapos siyang i-endorso ng Philippine Olympic Committee sa kabila ng pag-etsapuera sa kanya ng patafa. Umaasa si EJ na matatapos na ang lahat ng kontrobersyang ito para makapag-focus na siya sa iisang bagay, ang iwagayway ang watawat ng ating bansa sa international stage. To say, you know, I'm, I'm truly sorry. I'm sorry for, you know, this came to this point, the, you know, I lost an opportunity, but then in the bigger picture, the country lost an opportunity as well. But, you know, I'm praying for that and we're going to see some light into it soon. Nagbabalita mula sa frontline, Marty Bautista, News 5.